Hi, welcome back to Lycosis Games. We're gonna play some more Undertale. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. We'll talk to the person. A dog just rushed in here, filled with inspiration. It kept trying to build a snow dog that expressed its own emotions. But as it built, it kept getting more excited about the sculpture. This net got longer and longer, and it added more and more snow until it was rather sad to watch. But I couldn't turn away. <clears throat> All right, another one of these. Let's try this. It's so cute with the snow dog making snow dogs. Oh, it's so cute. It's so cute. Yay! Yay. I'm good at puzzles. Yeah, I'm glad you're good <clears throat> at puzzles because I'm not good at puzzles at all. I say no. that. No, go back, go back, go back through it. <laughs> Why? Because. Oh, there's a bird. <laughs> what the fuck? It's a hat. <laughs> Snow. <laughs> And that's it. Okay. It's a snow pop. Off. And this is a snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff. Is it really a snow puff? Behold! A snow puff. Eh? There's 30 gold inside this. What is this? Ah, it's a puppy! Look at him. No! <laughs> <laughs> There's the armor. <laughs> Look at all the dogs on him. This little sh Everything's made out of dogs. Great ex greater dog. It's so excited that it thinks fighting is just play. Bark, bark. It's waiting for your command. Bigger pet. Okay. It's too far away to pet. Oh. What? It changes color. It smells like freshly squeezed puppy juice. I call the greater dog. It bounds yep. towards. <laughs> Fucking slobber all over. Bark, bark. Watch out for the barks. It's seeking affection. It curls up in your lap as, a, as it is pet by you. It gets so comfortable it falls asleep. Then it wakes up. It's so excited. It's so excited. It's patting the ground with its front paws. <laughs> Ghost does that so often. Yeah, I'm just. <laughs> Greater dog picks up all the snow on the area and brings it to you. Now, dog is very tired. Hey! You want some TLC? As you pet the dog, it sinks its entire weight onto you. Your movement's slow. But you still haven't pet enough. Oh, just barely. Pet capacity is at 40%. Monster, monster can. candy. Yeah, monster candy. 10 HP. Alright, pet capacity, 40%. Is it X for back? X, yeah. Good. <laughs> It's the same as Pokemon. <laughs> yeah. We got lucky in this game. It's the same commands. Decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. <laughs> Flops over with its legs hanging in the air. It's contented. X. Forty gold. Yay. No. I didn't think your nose. And the butt is now in the top. <laughs> it's a snow puff. Okay, good. We have the 30 gold from it, though. Woof. 
Must be bigger on the inside. Should I go to out back and down first? Yeah. I don't know which way is the actual. The other way is the actual way, but. Good. Roof trot. Check. Some teens decorated it as a prank. He's saying get the decorations off. Oh. Okay. What? What? Stocking filled with chicken nuggets. Oh. Ice cream. Yeah. You look nice today, honey. I'm a stupid. Oh. Oh, what? Childhood photograph of Snow Drake. <laughs> Problems have been taken away. <coughs> Yay! Good job. We helped the poor animal. What the? Looks like a house. What fucking house is that? Is that the house in the ruins where Toriel was? Maybe. I don't know, I've never seen that before. Squeak. It's a door. There's some hidden... There is, but you can't reach it until endgame. Okay. Some sometime during the end of the game. I'm not surely sure when. Oh, well, we'll have to try and do that. Sorry, I haven't been talking much. I'm trying to figure out where on earth I'm going. So we haven't decided on a, on like a topic for today. Oh, damn it. Human, this is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the gauntlet of deadly terror. When I say the word, it will change. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Yeah. Because I am about to do it. A random dog hanging from a string. <laughs> well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm I'm about to activate it now. That uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge seems maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I'm a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair. And my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct to no class at all. Away it goes. <coughs> what are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Okay. Good job defeating that puzzle. I don't know what I was going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. Okay. I understand blue attacks. And for those of you that are back, thank you for dealing with the hour-long episode. Yeah, that was... This will not be that. No. No, 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 no. <laughs> we can't. Wait, well, I guess this is... This is number three. Oh, this is number three. So, okay, the last one wasn't an hour long either. No, last one was about 30. 30 minutes long? Probably. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. 
or something of that sort. Hey, it's a bunny. A hundred and eighty-seven gold. Yeah, we have a good amount of gold. Oh, okay. I'm thinking about getting this manly bandana. Okay. Because we don't really need weaponry. Yeah. But manly bandana. It has abs on it. Okay. Anyway, we need more healing stuff. So, I would go with the bicycle. Because it's it heals 11 HP, but you can... There's two of them for one. Let's try to talk. Hiya. Welcome to Snowden. Can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? The capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? Grubbies has food. Library has information. If you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. Okay. If you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. There's two of them. They just showed up one day and asserted themselves. The town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. Think back to your history class. Long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head up for the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided they'd like, like the cold and set up camp in Snowden. Don't even think about trying to explore the ruins. Door's been locked for ages, so unless you, you're a ghost or can burrow under the door, forget about it. Hmm. Okay. Bye now. Cool. We have things. We do have things. You want to put on that manly bandana? I want to see. Then we can put away the bandage. Actually, we can use the bandage. Hmm? We can use the bandage. How can we use the bandage? As an item. It heals HP. Oh, okay. Well, I am going to put the snowman piece in there. Okay. Because I get the feeling we should have it later. Okay. Okay. Welcome to Snowden. <laughs> what? Welcome to the Snowden. Snowden. Oh. Okay. <laughs> What night is 80 gold? No, you should stay. We don't have 80 gold. You should stay. Why? Just stay. At least I spent that. <laughs> That sounds cool, doesn't it? <laughs> Is that how I sound when I snore? Oh my god. I wish that's how you sounded. Is that how I sound when I snore? No. You're supposed to be nice and tell me I don't snore. <laughs> I thought I was supposed to be nice and not lie. <laughs> you look like you had a great sleep. Which is incredible because you were only up there for t about two minutes. Feel free and come back if you get tired. Look at your health. How do you look at your health? C. Stat. 30 out of 20. Yeah. Hmm. Heh. Skip all that bullshit. Well, we can go through the town if you want. Is there anyone else we should talk to in here? Uh, not really. Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell, because you're wearing a striped shirt. Little monster kid. And there's grillbees. bees. 
I like that music. I love the music in this game. It's it's one of my favorite parts about this game. I just love the music. What's up here? Hit uh -huh. X or enter. Oh. What a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. That's it. <laughs> some people have weird kinks. Not kink shaming. Just some people have weird kinks. That could be our topic for the day. What? Weird kinks. Oh, yeah. What about them? I don't know. You know a lot more about kinks than I do. I just dealt with a lot of people with that have a lot of different things. Yeah, welcome to the library. Yes, we know. The sign is misspelled. Library? I guess. I can't read it. The text is too small. I should really be wearing my glasses. Library. Library? It's a mailbox overflowing with unread junk mail. It's locked. It's locked from the inside. Doom, boom, 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 boom. The fuck? Hypervirus. Human, allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover, the admiration for another's puzzle solving skills, the desire to have a cool, smart person think you are cool. These feelings, they must be what you are feeling right now. I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. What? <laughs> It'd be fun resetting this as soon as she finished reading it so that she has more to read. After all, I am very great. I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not, I shall be lonely no longer. I, the great papyrus, will be your... No. No, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are human. I must capture you. Then I can fulfill my lifelong dream. <laughs> I'm gonna stab you. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's papyrus. The newest member of the Royal Guard. Alright, let's not die! No, don't fight! Oh. So you won't fight. Okay, good. You didn't fucking hit him. Oh my god. Oh my god. Don't go into him! You have the force of gravity. You're blue now. That's my attack. Okay. He likes to say ne he he. Flirt? You gonna fight? He's too busy fighting. Well, oh, he hi. was gonna throw out a bone attack. <laughs> so you're gonna flirt with his bone? Well, I'm gonna throw out a bone attack. I hope someone flirts with me. So next time. Never mind. Never mind. I'm not getting into that discussion. What? Nothing. About your bones. Insult him? He's too busy fighting. I don't... I don't get it. Oh! That was fast. Papyrus, head of the Royal Guard. Oh, you were still invisible. He's considering his options. So flirt with him now. 
Oh. Okay. And Dine will be really proud of me. You're about to die. Bicycle. Or an ice cream. Either way. It doesn't matter. Is it just me or is his attacks like really slow? Like, I thought they were faster than this. Maybe you should just spare him. I don't know. Prepares a non-bone attack and then spends a minute doing something. <laughs> Try sparing him. How will I know if people sincerely like me? I'm not wrong though, this, this, this is really slow for him, right? Cause I, I thought it was faster. Ooh, ah! Oh. Ooh, his bones can grow. He's trying to play it cool. Invisible. No. <coughs> I'm sorry. I have a really bad cough. Yeah. Ah, really? What? <laughs> Give up or face my special attack. Very soon he will use a special attack. It's okay. It's your last chance. Dog sell the bone. <laughs> Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone. What are you doing? Come back here with my special attack. Might heal. The unicycle. Because there's only one of them now. All of your attacks. <laughs> what the? F <laughs> it said a cool dude. Go 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 go. Don't, don't antagonize it. <laughs> well, I, it's clear you can't defeat me. 
I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore, I, the Great Papyrus, elect to grant you pity. I will spare you, human. Now's your chance to accept my mercy. Yay! We didn't die. You didn't die. You did good. What? That was nuts. I'll never join the Royal Guard. And my friend Qu Quantity will remain stagnant. What should you say? Let's be friends or what a loser? Let's be friends. What? You want to be friends with me? I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wow, I have friends. And who knew all I needed to do to make them was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them. You have taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to pass through. And I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Ah. Anything, <laughs> anything can enter through it, but uh. nothing can exit. Except someone with a powerful soul. Yeah, it's, like you. It's definitely your turn to talk. I've been talking for <laughs> That's why 20 the king minutes. wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with a soul with soul power. The soul power. <laughs> Sorry, I'm having an undercover brother moment. I don't know that movie. <laughs> then, us then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you will have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all monsters. He is, well, a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I'm certain if you just say, excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyways, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free and come by and hang out. <laughs> so I just realized something. We weren't able to flirt with him, so we can't go on a date with him. Oh? Yeah. No, go back. Uh, go the other way. Well, his house is right over here. I guess you gotta save. We still got a few minutes. So you came back to see me? You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. It's his favorite place, apparently. What? There's a fire. It's a joke book. Take a look inside. Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside. There's another quantum physics book. I don't get it. Welcome to the, the scenic my house. Enjoy and take your time. I don't get the quantum physics joke. We can ha hang out like a pair of really cool friends. You're not reading these. Oh. Hey! Those are, those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday. Even though basically it just happened. So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start hanging out? Begin the hangouts. Yes. Okay, let's hang ten. Hangout start. Here we are, hanging out. I've actually never done this before. But don't worry, you can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. I snagged an official hangout guidebook from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see, step one. Press the C key on your keyboard for friendship hug. I feel so informed. I think we're ready for step two. Ask them to hang out. Human. I, the great papyrus, I'm sorry, will hang out with you. That's not asking. He didn't ask us. Time for part three. Put on. on nice clothes to show you care. 
What's with the puppy on the radar? Where? Up top, upper right. Oh. I don't know. <laughs> Wait a second. Wear clothing. That bandana around your head. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that, earlier today you were also wearing clothing. No. Could it be? You've wanted to hang out with me from the very beginning? Yes. You broke papyrus. No. <laughs> you planned it all. You're way better at hanging out than I am. No, no, your friendship power. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you think so. you've bested me yet? <laughs> I, the great papyrus, have never been beaten at hanging out and never will. I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. So do I. I'm not wearing anything under my regular clothes, so... <laughs> Just in case someone wants to hang out, behold... BEHOLD ME! <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Oh, what should I say? What do you think? Either way. Honey, this is all up to you. No! A genuine compliment! <laughs> However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This hangout won't escalate any further unless you find my secret. You but that won't happen. I see, I see you like caressing my biceps with a floating heart. Sorry. <laughs> but who doesn't? This shirt didn't really, really say cool, but I improved it. Expert tip, all clothing articles can be approved this way. My hat, my hat, my hat. Well then, you found my secret. <laughs> I suppose I have no choice. It's a present! A present just for you! Do you know what this is? That is spaghetti. I it's think spaghetti. so. <laughs> it's spaghetti! That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right. But oh, so wrong. This ain't any plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silk and spaghetti finally aged in an oaken cask, then cooked by me. I don't want my spaghetti aged. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Chef, that reminds me, have you seen the, the stuff with the aged steak? I don't understand. Yeah, the, where it, the dry age where they basically let it rot. Yeah, and it and grows it, mold. Oh, it just, it breaks apart the, mole the, the beef molecules and, yeah, it's called decay. Yeah. Like, <laughs> like I don't, I don't want to eat my steak. Moldy, thank you. I want to eat a steak as close to being butchered as possible. Oh, yeah, definitely. Like, <laughs> sorry. Sorry for the tangent, guys. Oh, I love steak. Then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Human, it's time to end this. There's no way this can go any further. Eat it. You take a small bite. Your face reflexively scrunches up. The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression! You must really love my cooking! Sorry, we're trying to figure out voices for these, so... I'm not. I'm not doing voices, because I can't and do voices. by extension, me! Maybe even more than I do. Ugh! 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 <laughs> no! I'll have what he's having. <laughs> I can't. Human. It's clear it's now. It's clear now. You're completely obsessed with me. Everything you do, everything you say, I'll be there for you. It's all been for my sake. For my sake. Sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus. Hmm. Well, I'm flattered that you care so much. But maybe cool it a little bit? You are a very nice person, and I'm glad we're friends. 
that I think you can reach your max potential if you live more for your own sake rather than just mine. Hey, I know the solution. You should hang out with my boss and dine. I think if you, sh if you spread your friend energy out more, you'll have a, a more healthy lifestyle. Yeah, let's be friends with Undyne. Oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime. Platonically. Well, this is actually very interesting. Because in the true pacifist run... Mm -hmm. I'm waiting till you're... Oh. Till you're done looking around. Oh, yeah, I am. I'm gonna head towards save okay. point. It's in the igloo. Go in the igloo. But it's very interesting, because in the original pacifist run, if you don't do anything else beforehand, that turns into you go on a date with Papyrus. Oh, yeah? Yeah, and he tells you that he doesn't want to date you, he just wants to be friends. So in this one, I find it really interesting that he wouldn't flirt with you, and he wouldn't acknowledge you. Mm-hmm. So... In the fight, it was highlighted every time. Was it? Yeah. He's too busy, f capital fight, I-N-G, oh. you, fighting yeah, you. he's too f busy fighting you. And that's really interesting. I enjoy, I enjoy this because it shows how much the game actually changes based on everything that you have done thus far. Yeah. I wish I could have deleted my stuff so we could actually have a fresh run, but it's yeah. kind of interesting to everyone else I've seen. To, everyone else I've seen do pacifist runs. They've started with nothing, so all of yeah. the dialogue is is the same. And this is really interesting because certain things have changed. Is it bad? I kind of want to change the under the pacifist run to pacifist sort of run. <laughs> <laughs> Just have a, like a little like sort of with a tick mark yeah we could like we up could underneath between running the the r and the t yeah just do it in red <laughs> yeah. yeah in the you murderer font yeah, <laughs> yeah i like that let's do that <laughs> all right guys so this is gonna be changed up here thank you guys for coming out and watching episode three of undertale the sort of semi-pacifist run um, I'm sorry there's not a lot of, like, us talking. There's a lot of dialogue in this game. A so lot, of, lot it, of dialogue and a lot of me trying to concentrate and not getting slapped with bones. So. so <laughs> shut up. Not a word. <laughs> but if you like this video, leave a like. If nothing else, give a... Uh, click, click above our head to subscribe. I figured out how to do things in the video. It's going to be there? It's going to be right above it's us. It's going to be there. And you can check out our other videos over there. Over that side. That way. Yeah, that way. <laughs> I'm leaving the social media and most of you two over here. I'm the one doing editing and everything else. So, but with that said, everyone enjoy the rest of your week. And we will see you either Friday for our uranium run or next Wednesday back here for another episode of Undertale's semi pacifist run. Yay. Bye. See you guys later.